Okay, welcome back for World 6. There's supposed to be one up back there, but I'm not gonna try and get it. I'm gonna be unlucky and not get it. Oh my gosh! I'm having an unlucky day today, people. Not really an unlucky day, not in just this game, but in real life. Unlucky day. Now let's just beat this level. Oh, I already did. So what? Oh, sweet. I got an extra life by glitching. Oh, wait. That wasn't technically a glitch. Ultimate jump. Now there is like five secret pipes in here that can lead you through the entire level, but I'm not going to go through them. Ah, darn it. Hit that coin block, go there, and that'll get you to a vine. People have been asking me about that for a long time. They said there was a secret vine and they couldn't find how to get to it. And there's how you get to it. Star. The level. I beat the level with a star still on. It's awesome. I wish there was a glitch. Like if you did that, then um, you could keep it on forever. Just saying for people who like to do this without any power-ups or anything, I'm just saying, I wish there was. Now this is a really difficult level, but I, I seem to be making it past this part. Now when you get here, that's when the bullet bills start coming. Ready to kill you. Now when you get to the castle in this world, you'll you'll just be shocked. You'll just be shocked completely. You'll see what I mean when I get into it. Oh my gosh. It's the exact same as World 1 castle except with fireballs. And those things are, oh my gosh, did I just seriously do that, people? It's just another lazy level for Nintendo. What's that, the third one in a row now? I think I counted correctly. Get the power up. You'll definitely need it. This castle's got some upgrades. Ouchies, run, Mario, run. Just run. Whoa! First time he will have hammers, and I don't know how I just did that. Four in that one. I still don't understand how they fit through that, but who really cares now? Wow, I'm already in the seventh world. See, this is a short game if you're doing a walkthrough. Or even playing, in fact. But then again, I have beat this game. I've got it last year, and I have beaten it about maybe 50 times. Whoa, I just, like, glitched and got on that pipe somehow. Return of the Hammer Brothers, as we all enjoy the Hammer Brothers. That try and kill us all. Whoa! People, I've always struggled at that. Set of Hammer Brothers. I'm glad I didn't during the walkthrough. And oh my gosh, I keep getting hit. The 5,000. Beating the first level in World 7 and haven't died yet. That's pretty good. Now when it gets to World 8, that's when you guys really want to throw your game. World 7 slash 2. Another disappointing and lazy level. The exact same as 2 slash 2. The exact same. Nothing has changed. Except maybe more bloopers have been added, but still what? Still, there's still too much laziness in Nintendo. 
in this game. Oh my gosh. They probably did add more bloopers because I have, I don't remember stopping at all. Well, of course, then I did have a mushroom. Hurry up. I would have gone, people, but that green cheap cheap was in the way. What's the point of the green cheap cheeps and the red cheap cheeps? They all do the same thing until new Super Mario Bros. Wii. It's when the green cheap cheeps chase you. Oh my gosh, no! I'm gonna die, people. Oh my gosh! Oh, oh so close. Whew. Getting lucky in this game. This is second, people. Okay, I'm back. I had to do something for a second. Now after this level, that's when I'll turn it off. Unless I die in this level. This level is really easy to die in. It's the same as 2 slash 3 you. And I guess I'll see you for the rest of 7 slash 3 on the next episode.